A new legal move in the battle over the FBI search of former President Trump's Florida estate. His lawyers filed a lawsuit against the Department of Justice after agencies' documents at Mar-a-Lago. Reporter Trinity Chavez has the very latest. Former President Donald Trump wants to stop federal agents from going through documents seized during the search of his Florida home. Trump filed a lawsuit seeking a special master or third-party attorney to be appointed to review the documents. He's also requesting the FBI return any documents that went beyond the scope of the search warrant. It happens sometimes, and I think from the point of view of the Department of Justice and justice itself, as long as it doesn't take too much longer uh, and delay things, that's fine. The Justice Department responded with a statement saying the search was authorized by a federal court upon the required finding of probable cause. Federal Judge Bruce Reinhart could decide this week whether any portions of the affidavit used to authorize the search warrant can be made public. He's going to try to see, and the DOJ is going to try to see, if there are some discrete paragraphs that, that, that are actually educational to the public that they can go forward on. A U.S. official tells CBS News that the Justice Department retrieved at least 150 classified documents from boxes Trump handed over to the National Archives earlier this year. The National Archives released a letter it sent to Trump attorneys explaining that among the items turned over in January were more than 100 documents with classification markings comprising more than 700 pages. Some include the highest levels of classification, including special access program materials. We didn't see any indication or explanation about why he still had classified documents after the first turnover of records in February or the subpoena in June, why they kept finding these classified documents every time they came back. A Trump attorney signed a statement in June saying all classified material had been returned, but FBI agents found more classified material in this month's search. Trinity Chavez, CBS News, New York. The National Archives referred the matter of missing presidential records to the DOJ, which then convened a grand jury investigation.